trying to get sounds sorted out, trying to get things sorted out. Uh, we've got somebody on. Thank you, whoever that is. Appreciate you very much. Uh, get the chat box up and going. It's there. All right, playing some DuckTales remastered on the 360. All right. All right. Jim Morrison's bathtub. What's up, my man? How are you? I'm just going to hang out and play some DuckTales. I've never really played the game. I always suck to this game. That makes me feel real glad about myself. Um, I've, I've never played it. I've only played like 15 minutes of the original, which I really liked. Um... So I'm excited to try this one. I'm doing well, man. I'm doing good. Just kind of hanging out. Um, watch the Astros lose tonight or today, which was awesome. They stink. It's terrible. Thanks for stopping in, man. I hope uh, I appreciate it. I hope everything's good with you. So tell me, is it a uh, is it a difficult game? I like platformers. My chat is not showing up here. That stinks. Let me know if the audio is crap. There we go. Can I go in here? No. We're just gonna pogo around everything. Oh, what is that? Come back! Come back! Okay, no, okay I gotta jump to pogo. All right. But I mean, you gotta like Ducktales, though, right? Like, I'm pretty sure you grew up with it, like I did. The Beagle Boys, huh? So, kind of random question for you here, man. <laughs> I don't know if it's difficult or if I'm just bad. <laughs> I don't. I, I hope there's not a ton of combat in this game. I want it to be just a simple platformer. Never watched DuckTales? Oh man, it was classic in the 80s, 90s, whenever it was. Late 80s, early, early 90s. That and um, Tailspin. I watched a lot of Tailspin. So let me ask you kind of random question here, but since you're on and I want to kind of talk about it, I'll ask. Uh, have you watched the Fallout series? It seems to be a big deal right now. Um, and I just installed Fallout 4 on the Xbox One to play after this. Use the pogo. I can use B2. Okay. I like X. Oh, come back. Gotcha, bitch. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. I do love a good platforming game. And we're gonna do this thing just like that. Oh. And so I guess the whole premise of this game, right, is to collect treasure. Give it to me. Give me that bank. Walk up. On forward, and I'm gonna hold forward. What? Walk.
walk up to an item. Oh, okay. Oh, come on. So I, I didn't realize it was on Prime until tonight. Uh, we watched a Minion movie tonight. Um, but I saw it was on Prime and I kind of got excited. But like your comment, what you're talking about, is the very first I've heard about it being so left-wing. Which is, which is extremely disappointing. Not surprising. Um, that sucks, man. Oh. I'm not a huge Fallout fan either. I just, I just wanted to watch it. Um, I hate to hate to hear it's got a bunch of left-wing propaganda. Looks like we got one more person on lurking. How are you doing? Whoever you are, thanks for stopping in. Uh, just hanging out, playing some DuckTales. I do really like the uh, artwork and the style of the game. Uh, what do I got to do here? Nice. Yep, we got Dewey. That's right. We got Dewey. Oh no! Oh, that makes me feel so old. Ah, that's all good though. That that's good. Nice. All right, two thousand. Okay, I can see that. Cause in two thousand, Ducktales really wasn't on. I can, I can, I can see that. Where's that hammer? There it is. Where's the next one? Yeah, Ducktales stopped airing like mid nineties, uh, and then it's like stopped airing altogether. Like Top Cat. I don't, I don't know what Top Cat is. I've never heard of Top Cat. I don't think. Pogo, Pogo. Uh, can I get that? I missed the jewel. Ah, come on. Nope. Oh, all right, moving on. I'll take that. Uh, and bounce, and bounce. Pogo, give me that bank, and we'll swipe that forward. Let's go. Whatever this guy's name is. Boom. Uh. Uh, I didn't mean to break that, but I still got the bank. Looks like it's just me and you, Jim Morrison. Oh, come on. Run, 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 run. Okay. I have not heard that it's too much of a shooter. I, I've heard that it's not as deep as Fallout 3 as far as dialogue and story goes. Um... I did kind of enjoy my time with Fallout 4. Oh man, like, I don't know, six, seven, eight years ago. Um, oh, damn. Oh, damn. Damn it. Um, I did enjoy my time with Fallout 4. I am looking forward to playing it some more tonight and starting over. I do feel like I need a game that's open world that I can just come back to repeatedly and keep going. I don't typically feel that way because I kind of feel like open world games are kind of overplayed. But I do feel like I need one. So I think Fallout 4 is going to be it. Or, or 3. I haven't decided yet. But that's really cool to hear that it's uh, one of your favorite games. And yeah... That's right, you know, that's where you're from, man. That's awesome. We got a lurker hanging out, and that's so cool. My chat's not showing up on my one screen, but that's okay. You crook. Oh. 
get him. I guess I gotta swipe him. Or not. Okay, if this isn't gonna work, what do I do then? Okay, I think I see it now. Alright. No, no! Nice. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Let's go. Throw it. Oh, and it'll bounce. Oh, jump on his head. Oops, here we go. I love it. One more, one more, maybe one more, maybe, maybe two more. Jump on his head. Bounce. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Uh, I'm just catching up with your comment here. Uh, follow fool. Yeah, I kind of remember the storyline. Looking for your son versus looking for your dad. Um, I do, like, I do, though, really like the aspect of Fallout 3 that you can detonate a nuke. <laughs> so that kind of makes me want to go back to it. But I do like the um, settlement building elements of Fallout 4. So I think that's what I'm going to go with. Hannah Barb, Nice. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm familiar with Hannah Barbara. Okay. Or Barbara, Barbara. Um, top cat, top cat. Let me, let me Google it. We're just hanging out, right? Nothing fancy here. We're just hanging out. Let me Google Top Cat. Let me Google it. Top Cat. I don't know. Um, I don't know Top Cat. Which is kind of surprising because I've watched a lot of older cartoons when I was younger. Uh, specifically a whole lot of Tom and Jerry. The old school really good Tom and Jerry. Um, very cool that you watched that. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. When cartoons were great, now they're kind of trash. Alright. Oh, jump, dodge that. Jump on his head. Bye, yow. Oh, really fool? You want to do that? Alright. Bye, yow. Oh, okay, okay. Alright. So I hit him five times, I think, last time. Oh, damn. Come on. One season? Really? That's kind of interesting. I didn't think it'd be one season. I figured it would probably run close to, like, I don't know, seven or eight. Oh, I have heard this about this game. You gotta start over every time. It's old school. Yeah, early 2000 cartoons. I'm trying to remember what they were. I don't know. I'm going to say, like, I, I don't I don't know. Like, I wasn't watching. I don't. Oh, man. I know they weren't good, though. But, again, I grew up watching, like, uh, Space Ghost, Coast to Coast, Johnny Bravo, Dexter, DuckTales, Tailspin, and then, like, the original Power Rangers, which wasn't a cartoon, but it was still one I watched. Can I skip this? I've got to start this level all over again. And the cutscene? That's lame. That's lame. Skip. Oh, there it is. Okay, I can skip. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go. Let's go. All the way th through the level again. Collecting my bank. I got to get paid. I'm just going. Oh, come on. Skip cinematic. Uh, uh. Okay, I remember that now. They tried to remake uh, Johnny Johnny Quest, right? Johnny, they remade Johnny Quest. I never liked the original, and when they tried to remake it, I was over it. I got, I got it, I got it. <laughs> I know, dude. Like, when you find out what Johnny Bravo's about, you're like, oh, oh, I'll, like, 
He was such a pimp, man. Johnny Bravo was a straight up pimp. And you still see memes about Bravo today, which is awesome. I know I'm supposed to collect all the treasure, but I'm trying to get back to the boss. You know what's up. Swipe that. Bounce. 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 Like, I'll even go as far as to say that, like, even, like, the Powerpuff Girls were pretty decent. But, yeah, that was, that was, uh, late 90s. Top five, easily top five. Oh, man, I wish you could have watched, uh, Space Ghost. Space Ghost was legit. Cartoon, late night, like, Jimmy Fallon talk show. Uh, some throw it off stuff, man. I don't care about that. Let's go. Let's go. I do love a good platformer. Especially, like, 2D. I love them. Thanks again for hanging out, man. Thanks for checking the stream out and stopping by. I, I always do appreciate when you come on. The fact that you would take, like, some of your Saturday night and hang out with me is awesome. I really, I mean that. That's awesome, dude. Uh, bye, Al. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. I still think easily one of the top five... Oh, that's awesome, man. Thank you for that. I really appreciate that. I still think, I, I still believe that the original Tom and Jerry is probably my favorite number one cartoon. Or, uh, damn. Damn it. Or some of the original, like, Looney Tunes. I love hanging out with you too, man. I, I love that you jump on. I was secretly hoping Jim Morrison would jump on when I started scheduling this. I mean, I don't do a ton of streams anymore. Well, I really never did, but I'm trying to do more of them. Just to hang out with people. <laughs> okay, so I have to admit, I didn't know that uh, this this guy here. Um, I guess I didn't know they were in theaters. <laughs> I did. I was like, man, he stopped by last time. I hope he stops by again. Skip cinematic. All right, dodge these things. All right, dodge them. And jump on him. I think yeah, like he does mix it up here and throws him a couple of different directions, which is it mixes it up. And we've got somebody else on. Thank you for stopping by, whoever you are. I appreciate it. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh no. Uh. Maybe one more. Maybe two more. Got him. Got him. Let's go. I believe that. I do believe it predates um, television being common. I, I, I do. I believe that. I'm with you on that. What's really cool is my kids watch um, the old school Tom and Jerry and they like prefer it much to the new ones. Like, I like that about your grandfather. That's awesome. Not sure, but I know how to find it out. I'll 
feed it into my supercomputer and use Gyro's new crypto analysis program. Then we'll know what the Beagle Boys were after. So I think, I think you helped make up my mind for me that I am going to go with Fallout 4 and start that one. Roaming Dan! What's up, my brother? How are you, man? What's going on with Roman Dan today? What are you up to, my brother? Thanks for stopping by. I, I do appreciate it. Love when a Roman Dan drops me a comment or stops by. Oh, come on. Let's go. I don't want to skip it, but... Skip it. Yeah, I just wanted to hang out and play some DuckTales. Uh, okay, I get to pick a level here. All right, so Amazon, Transylvania, African Mines, the Himalayas, the moon. I'm thinking the moon. Let's go with the moon. I don't know how to say that first word. Chronicle 100 of Heroes. Is that a new, is that a new game? I haven't heard of it. Eden, Iden, Euden, Chronicle 100 Heroes. Uh, what's that on? I haven't heard of it. But I saw you sent TC some really awesome games on, on Twitter or whatever. I saw his post. Um, and yeah, dude, you, you found some PS5 games that I've never heard of that are really dope. And I know he's very grateful for. Um, and dude, he's got a really nice house. I'm, uh, I'm super proud of him. Super proud of his wife. Everything they've accomplished to get this new house, I'm so happy for them. When I got to, when I got to see it um, a couple weeks ago, when I was there for the Midwest Gaming Classic, I was super happy for them. Yeah, dude, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do Fallout Four. Oh, okay, the Sukaden, Sui Koden. Sorry, Sui Koden. I think that's how you say it, right? Oh, you know it's there, and it's been devastated, and you know it's there. That's awesome. That's awesome, man. That You know it's there, so you know what's up, even though it's, like, nuked. That's awesome. Skip the cinematic. I don't care. I want to play the game. Okay, so there's a map. Okay, so this is... Yeah, that's right, because the first game, or the original, is kind of an exploration game. Kind of. Oh, okay. So Boston's got a ton of one-way signs? I, I never would have thought. But Boston is a city that my wife and I have talked about for years that we, we have to get up to. I... I, I, I want to go to Fenway Park and watch a game. That's a bucket list. I do want to see Fenway Park. Oh. Huh. Yeah, like, TC was happy, and that was really nice of you to send him that. That was really nice of you, man. Nice housewarming gift. And again, like, he's got such a nice house. I'm so proud of the guy, and I'm so happy for him. He's got a nice game basement that he's making. And we hung out down there and played Master System uh, games all night. Ooh, almost didn't make it. Oh, dude. Like, ah! Damn. Yeah, like, I will absolutely hit you up. And we will hang out and drinks i don't know if you like to partake in adult beverages but they will be on me for sure i'm not gonna go that way see like that's what blows me away is like it's so awesome that like streaming making content is so difficult um but just the common theme of hanging out and playing video games is so uniquely powerful that we get to hang out and I get to meet like a bunch of people is awesome. Okay, well that's hey, kudos and 
Good for you. Please don't start. Ugh. Payal. Yeah, so Dan, I didn't because I can't zoom in on Twitter and my eyes are bad. What did you send TC? Because I'm very interested. They, they looked interesting. They looked unique. I know I've never seen them before. Oh, I got one life left. Oh, Come on. And I'm pretty sure that when I die here, I've got to start all over. Which is a double edged sword. It's kind of cool. It's a throwback to the old game, but also super kind of annoying at the same time. All right, so I guess that's a boss down there with a the skull. We're going to go check that out. Can I break those? No. Uh, what is this cheese I need? All right, so looks like I do have to do some exploration. No, no, that's, that's, that's cheap. And that's even cheaper. That's cheap. My wife was texting me earlier. What did she say? <laughs> Alright, she's out. My wife's out with a girls' night. Doing some things. There's a wine testing party she's at. So, she's hanging out. All right, forget the moon. Let's go to the Amazon. All right, let me see what you said here. Nice. I will be very interested to watch that for sure. Um, let me know on here if you can, if you've got an idea or a plan of when you are expecting to release it. Um, let me know so I can, I'll do what I can to make a note, take a snapshot of this. Um, because I will be very interested in watching that. And I think I've, I've, th I've talked about it before, maybe not on stream, but I have a hard time watching YouTube unless I'm very intentional with it. Because I, I don't watch much YouTube, despite creating. I, I really don't. I mean, I mainly watch YouTube for um, walkthroughs or um, when I got to work on a car, something like that, or I got to build something. But if you post something, I will definitely check it out. I'm very, that makes me that makes me excited, man. Skip cinematic. I don't care. So I'm glad I didn't have to beat the first boss again. I uh, didn't mean to do that. Now I can't get that. Leave me alone, you giant monkey. Oh, a big treasure chest there. What is that? I don't care what a nightingale is. Front mission first. I think I have heard of that one. Front mission first. Tactical RPG with robots. I think I have heard of that one. What's the map look like? I got, okay, I missed one. I got something coming up here. In a minute, I got something coming up. Oh, sweet, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Well, that didn't last long at all. Ooh, I got a heart back. Oh. 
Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Get off me. Okay. On Friday, huh? Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Come on. Friday is a good... It, Friday is a good day for me to watch YouTube uh, and, and watch some videos. I try to keep it... I try to keep it kind of low-key at work on Friday and not do too much. Um... Because I don't want to break anything on a Friday when the weekend's coming up. So if you post it on Friday, I will definitely check it out. I'll watch that. I'm excited for that. Alright, so let's get this cake here. Maybe it'll give me health back. Yes, full health. Retro Rob, my guy. How are you tonight, man? Thanks for stopping by. Ladies and gentlemen... I don't know how offended he's going to get, but we have John Wick, the man himself, in the chat. And I say that just a kid because I didn't realize it until you mentioned it in one of your videos. That, yeah, dude, you can be a stunt double for John Wick. Um, but, dude, thanks for stopping in, man. That's awesome. Uh, now, how do I get over to there without getting hurt? Yeah, and I like how you post at like 10.31 uh, because it's unique. I'm just going to get hurt. Oh, I didn't get hurt. Okay. I got hurt like that. Yeah, so uh, Rob, I've been watching some of your Xbox videos. I'm on a big Xbox kick lately. Come on. I need some health here. I need some health. I need, I need a cake. I need a heart. I need something. Oh, that's cheap. Yeah, man, I was telling TC, I didn't recognize you immediately at Midwest Gaming Classic, but once we started talking, I was like, yeah, I've seen, I, I watched that guy. And I, I like how chill your videos are. And dude, you have a very impressive game room that you were showing off in one of your videos. I loved all the RoboCop and Judge Dredd stuff you have. Nice. I needed that ice cream cone. It didn't. I guess it didn't help me much there, though. Oh, nice. Okay, so you got a 360 video coming out. I'll be I'll be checking that out. Dude, I bought like close to 20 games uh, for the 360 at Midwest Gaming Classic, and then I bought another 12 cents. It is its own house. Your game room it is its own house. It is. Skip cinematic. But yeah, Rob, we're just kind of hanging out. I'm just playing some DuckTales. I've never really played it. Nice. And, you know, Jay got me... Oh, damn. Jay got me into checking DuckTales out. What does my map look like? I don't have a map. There it is. Five games, but... Uh, a fear of missing out. Dude, that's a thing lately. I've seen that. That's kind of a trend right now. So that's like awesome that you're doing that. Because I know it's going to get a lot of views and a lot of watches. But Xbox 360 is kind of a system to collect for right now. And I wouldn't say I have fear of missing out. Um... But I love the system, so I do want to collect for it before it kind of goes out of style. Yeah, I've bought a lot of 360 games lately. Now, actually, I need to talk to him about it, but um, Jay and I are actually going to do a video together 
talking about um, like must own uh, 360 game or games 360 games that you would start your collection with. Oh come on! Okay, nice. I'll definitely be checking that video out because it's probably gonna make me spend some money. Uh, uh. I need some health. And I'm stuck now. Okay. Hey, must own but cheap is right up my alley. And I do love how cheap the 360 is right now. Again, like... I walked away with close to 20 games at Midwest Gaming Classic, and I spent maybe a hundred dollars, maybe. So there's something I gotta do right close to here, and I don't know how to get there. No, that thing got me again. So. Um, Jim Morrison's bathtub. I definitely understand what you were saying when we started the stream about this game being difficult. Come on. I have not played 007 Bloodstone. I've played uh, Quantum of Solace, which was pretty fantastic, I got to admit. Oh, come on. And y'all are watching me suck at this game. And we have somebody else that jumped on. Whoever you are, I appreciate you stopping by and hanging out with me on a Saturday for a few minutes. Or however long you hang out. Thank you. Oh. Oh, that sucks. Do I? Oh, come on. Orange Blitz, what's up, brother? It, it's proving to be tough as nails. This is like the third game over I've had. Um, Alright, starting over again here where I have to pick the level. So we've done the Amazon. We've done the moon. Um, Alright, so I'm going to take a break for like two or three minutes. Um, just to grab something to drink real quick. Um, let me know in the comments what you guys want to see or which level you guys want to see me play. And I will be right, right back. Let me know what you guys want to see. Back at it. Back at it. Alright, you want to see me go back to the moon? Alright. We will go back to the moon then. I feel like I need to stick with a level. And kind of give it my best here. Stick with a level. And just run with it. Yes, let's go to the moon. But yeah, uh, Rob. FOMO is a real thing right now. 
and I've seen on YouTube there's been a lot of good traction on FOMO so I think that video you released will do pretty well to the moon yeah I I'm, I'm pretty I'm, I'm pretty happy for you man I see a lot of your videos do really well and uh, that's exciting Well, okay, so you've beaten Ninja Gaiden, but DuckTales, DuckTales will kick your ass? Hey, I saw where Mr. Wright was doing FOMO stuff, so, and I think he had a video, am I, like, it was, the title was, Am I to Blame for FOMO? I think he, he plays a part in FOMO. I mean, him and I were talking about it at the Midwest Gaming Classic, and then, but he's been collecting for the, the 360 for a while. Oh, come on. Dude, he was wild to have on the stage. He was a trip and a half. Yeah, he was a trip and a half to have on the stage. I like I've never beat Ninja Gaiden. I've gotten pretty far in Ninja Gaiden, but I've I've oh damn, I, I knew that was coming. Alright. Uh but I I, I did want to um, stream the original DuckTales instead of this one but my retron 5 like refused to recognize um the cartridge in it okay so if he's been telling people for years to get the games then he's not to blame for fomo can i okay no i i feel you that if you put the time in it you can beat that if you put the time into ducktales you could beat it I absolutely agree. I'm not having a terrible time with the controls. Um, but I do feel like I'm kind of cheating, just pogoing my whole way through the level. Phantom, get down from there and stop embarrassing yourself. And I also like how Mr. Rightway, uh, what he collects for the 360, he likes to collect platinum hits or great greatest hits, whatever they're called. Um, yeah, uh, platinum hits. You can see that. Platinum hits. I do like how he collects that variant. Um, which is cool because you collect what you want to collect you collect what makes you happy um, and the fact that he's after that specific variant I think is cool alright skip the cinematic I don't care so we oh wow okay so we have made it farther than we did last time at the moon and now I have like there's no gravity pretty sure the rats can hurt me And I don't know what to do here. And I can't go that way. Okay, yeah, there we go. Yeah. He's unique, alright. I'm glad we had him on the stage, though. He brought that kid up and just doted on that kid. Had a good time with the kid. Um... Dude, yeah, you beat Contra without the code. Yeah, you could beat DuckTales. That's something I, I beat Contra once as a kid without the code with friends. And I felt super proud. Alright, let's go to the right here. Click my bank. 
I mean, I'll be honest. I haven't been going after all the loot. Just trying to survive, honestly. Uh. Uh. So I do have a problem or an issue with the um, rope controls. Like, I keep pressing A and I needed that. Oh, I needed that. I feel like it doesn't hold on. Right, like, right, I'm gonna fall. Dude, Contra's hard, man. Contra is hard. That's awesome that you beat it like that. Um, like, my kids and I play Contra, and, um, I mean, my, my girls are young, so my oldest isn't very good at Contra, but it's still fun to play it with them. And, oh, I need it. Oh, come on, come on. Alright, forget that way. Okay, yeah, so I saw your comment earlier about being in the army. The army. So, um... I've heard people don't like... people. I, I've heard people don't like being told this, but... I had, some, I had some friends of mine die in the Marine Corps, but... I will say thank you for your service, and I mean that, especially with like the world the world we live in today. This sucks. Yeah, so I was I was scheduled to go into the Marine Corps, and then failed like a punk, and didn't go. Um, but that was the plan or that was an idea I had for a while yeah man thank you for your service and Retro Rob again thank you for your service I know we were talking about that at the Midwest Gaming Classic oh. see I have a hard time with the rope Go all the way back down. And then I'm stuck here though. Alright, so keep going down. No biggie. It is a biggie, man. It's something to be very proud of. And I know you are. I know you're proud of it. You should be proud of it. That's awesome. All right, so we're gonna go down here. See, the rope kills me. No, 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 no. Nice. And infantry too, man. Nonetheless, infantry. Yeah, I, I can, I can believe you're thankful you survived. I, I can believe that. I had a buddy of mine who was doing some undercover ops uh, and some, um, oh, what do they call it? He was doing some, um, he was doing some, um, oh, damn, I can't even think right now, um, infiltration with, with some of the gangs, and he ended up not making it. I don't know why, but, um, or how. But definitely grateful for everybody that does any type of service. Alright, so we're going to go down in a minute. The rope kills me. Every time, the rope kills me. I don't like the controls of the rope. So that's what I need right here. Retro Fusion Gaming. What's up, man? How are you? Dude. You've been posting some straight fire on Twitter lately, man, and I love it. I, I appreciate it, man. We need we need more people like that that post that got that type of stuff. 
that's not popular popular to say but it's true man that rope kills me retro fusion how are you man thanks thank you for stopping by man i appreciate it i'm uh hanging out playing some ducktales just hanging out for a bit before I go and play uh, Fallout 4. Thanks to uh, Jim, Morrison, Jim Morrison's bathtub. That's what I'm playing next. Oh, damn. I didn't watch I didn't watch it. I did see he released it. I do want to go back and watch it. Um, yeah, I do want to watch what he posted. Um, he was a blast to talk to, um, and honestly, I didn't, oh, damn it, I didn't know a ton about him when, when I interviewed, or when we interviewed him, so I, I had to, I had to do some research before, before that, which was cool, because I watched some of his stuff and was super excited to talk to him. Dude. All right, time out. The new road hall, the the new roadhouse is so awesome, especially if you just like, if you turn off your brain and just watch Roadhouse. Fantastic film. I loved it from start to finish. I didn't go in thinking it was gonna be a masterpiece. I went into it watching it like, again, turn off my brain. Consider it a Fast and the Furious movie type, right? And just enjoy it for what it is and my wife and i we had such a good time watching it uh, jake gyllenhaal conor mcgregor the whole cast roadhouse is, is awesome best popcorn movie in years yeah it really is pretty dope i was very surprised and pleased with it oh dope so pat uh uh he reached out to you man patman reached out to you that's all i know you were super excited to meet him um and you were talking about it during his interview how he was a legend this and that um so very cool that's awesome man and he, he does a lot of stuff so i like the original too um but the new roadhouse is a great movie i i really highly recommend it um it's just so throwed off um great action film it's got some great one-liners in it um there's some stuff I didn't really think needed to happen in it. Um, but I think it does its job really well. It's a pretty solid action movie. Again, just go in with low expectations. That's cheap. You're going to drop me right on that guy. That's cheap. But yeah, we really enjoyed it. I know I'm rambling and repeated that multiple times, but I highly recommend it. But again, like I'll, I'll say it a million times. Thank you all for, for jumping on and hanging out for a few minutes. It really means a lot. I really appreciate it. Uh, give me that bank. The fact that you guys would hop on on Saturday and spend a few minutes with me is awesome. Can I jump down here? Am I gonna, am I gonna die? Can I go down? Okay, I think I can go down over here. Let me get back. I gotta figure out how to break that though. Yeah, the cane doesn't work. It was bad for your blood pressure. I can understand. The game can be like it's 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 frustrating, especially playing it. I don't know if easy mode is different, where when you die you start over or you don't start over. Let's go. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. There wasn't a rope. I knew. It. That's so cheap. It drops me right on that guy. That's so cheap. All right, uh, I used to care more about politically correct on Twitter. Dude, there's so much negative. Like, it's... Like, I enjoyed what, what, what you posted on Twitter because it's needed. It's crazy to me. We're, like, 
all the politics. And all of the 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 inaction that goes on. Alright, I'm kinda lost here. Where is he going? Uh fall to his death. I needed that ice cream cone and that one. Give it to me. Oh, that sucks. Give me that though. I needed that. Or I wanted that. Oh, that's... Which, uh... I have too much pride to play easy mode. So do I. I, I just, I want to beat it on normal. Yeah, again, like, you're never going to make people happy. It doesn't matter your stance. You're never going to make people happy. Like, my biggest advice about being political is just stand by your morals. Stand by what you believe in and, and hold true to that. And just, like, I'll be honest, my morals are not left-wing. So it's definitely kind of frustrating. But I, I don't run the government. I don't, I have no say. The rope kills me. I have no lives left. I have one heart left. Oh, there it goes. Easy all the way. I don't want to start over again. Oh, alright, we're going back to the moon. What is this? A. Go to my vault. But there's no shame in playing. Like, why would people shame you for playing on easy? Nice. I got an achievement. Nice. Like video games, I believe, like should be relaxing and yeah, you play you, you do you. Hey, like I, I, I respect that. If you're gonna lean left, that's cool. Um, again, you do you. You hold true to what you believe in. Um, but to hear you say that you believe it's gotten ridiculous, I think that goes a long way. And I think I'm one of the few in Texas, and we're getting on politics here, but I think I'm one of the few in Texas that really believes that our government should be a bipartisan government like it was kind of intended to be. And you should take ideas from the left wing and the right wing and come together on things and have agreements and make the country run that way. That's not how it's done. At least not right now. The moon is killing me. We had a good run last time. We got some of the gadgets. We had a good run. Oh, go, 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 go. Don't die. I feel that like you feel like you're not accomplishing something I, I feel that um, that's one reason why I, I enjoy playing one of the games I'm playing through now I think I mentioned it before is Dark Souls 3 oh that's so cheap again the rope kills me that rope kills me the rope controls suck in this game But yeah, that's why I enjoy playing the Souls games. Because I do feel like I've really achieved something. And I'm kind of stuck on Dark Souls 3 now, but... I'll make it past. I'll make it past it. 
Oh, nice. So, um, yeah, let me know when you're going. I haven't seen the um, the museum. I know it's in Frisco. I haven't seen it, but do let me know when you're going because I'll take my kids and we'll just hang out. I wanted to take my daughter to um, the game convention in Austin this year. Um, whatever it's called, I can't remember it right now. But I'm actually going to be um, out of town that weekend, so I can't take her. But the um, the museum would be cool. But yeah, her her and I will do um, Retro Palooza. So if you do come to Retro Palooza in uh, Pasadena, we'll hang out for sure. Classic Game Fest. Yes, thank you. Uh, we went there last year. TC actually came down and hung out in Texas last year, and we had a great time um, at the Game Fest. Facts, Jim. Okay, so you're going to Siege. Nice. Very cool. I went to Siege back in 2022 and had a fairly decent time. Alright. Hit all of these. Watch the rats who want to kill me. Oh, come on. Nice. Yeah, so I've met the Game Chasers. They're really, really cool people. Um, really great guys. A lot of fun to hang out with. Really cool people. All right, we beat that. All right, so my map says I need to go up. Yeah, we had a good time at Classic Game Fest. Um, bought a lot of games, but the prices really weren't that great. Um, but we both kind of got invited, which was cool. So we both had, again, like early access, like we did at uh, Midwest Gaming Classic. So we were, we were, the damn rope. We were able to um, hang out and have a good time. And thanks for watching the video, man. That's awesome. I appreciate that. Yeah, Seth, like TC's done a lot. TC's got some great videos. His editing is top notch. Uh, absolute quality. All right, we're going to go up here. The year seems like a lot less YouTubers, more, vo more voice actors. Yeah, like that's that. We had a lot of voice actors. Damn it. There was a lot of voice actors at Midwest Gaming Classic. Um, oh, damn. I hit him with a pogo stick. I'm getting crushed here. Yeah, Seth is, a, Seth is a great guy. Catching up on the comments here. Uh, by the way... So if you see a profile picture, that says... Okay, uh... Alright, sweet. So I will know to uh, check your video out next Friday. I hope you release it. I do want to check it out. Yeah, I... That's what it comes down to, is watching YouTube and hanging out with, ah, damn, with friends. Got him. Is he going to jump up or no? Where is this going? And I'll say it all night. Thanks again for you guys hanging out. All right. Dulce mio, dulce mio, dulce mio. 
Dos Mio. I don't want to go back to my vault. I don't need to do that. Why not do that? Go back. Yeah, DuckTales is proving to be difficult. I mean, I do like my platformers very linear, and this isn't, but it's still pretty cool. Yeah, man, just, just make the video. I, I know that's a lot easier said than done, uh, because I've gone through several phases on my channel where I haven't made videos for a while because I've been burnt out, but that's what you have to do. You just have to make it, put it out, and whatever happens, happens. Um, and make sure, above all, that you're happy with what you put out and you're happy doing it. Because I've been there where I wasn't happy making YouTube videos, and it really just sucked and really burned me out. All right, so just disclaimer here: this is gonna be this is gonna be my last run for the night because I do want to play Fallout Four. It's it's Jim Morrison's fault. I'm gonna play Fallout Four in a little bit and uh, kind of hang out. Depends how far I get here. The moon's killing me. The moon is absolutely killing me. Alright, let's go up. But I am having fun though. I do enjoy this game. I think it's pretty legit. Exactly. Exactly, dude. No video is ever going to be perfect. You're always going to critique yourself. You're always going to have things that you don't feel are perfect that you're going to want to go back and edit. But that's just part of the process. Oh, here we go. Rescue him. Hit the three switches. Dodge the rats. Let's go. Skip cinematic. No gravity. Dodge the rats. Hit that. Hit that. Let's go. Yeah, the music's dope, man. I mean, like, like, come on. Like, even, the, even the theme song is, is great in this game. Skip cinematic. Can I go back? Let's go back down and see if I can now pick up that part of the spacesuit. I hate the rope controls. Oh, they kill me. Nice. I can pick it up. All right. Sweet. Skip cinematic. All right. Let's, we got to go up. We got to go up. It, dude, exactly. Self-doubt, lack of confidence, or just, you know, like that type of stuff with YouTube is just going to burn you out. Just just put it out. That, again, it's easier said than done, but just just make it. Uh. Yeah, just put it out there and just like just be happy with what you make and enjoy making it. Because people will know if it's content that makes you happy, people will know. If you don't enjoy it, people will know. Because it'll show in your quality and if you're looking to get views and stuff like that, But I'm excited, again, I've said it all night. I'm excited that you're doing that. I'm excited to watch it. You watch all of my stuff, so I'm excited to see what you got. I did a bad job on video. I can just record. <laughs> I do understand and appreciate that comment that if you feel like it's bad, damn it. Hey, nobody's gonna watch it. I, I I do understand, and I do understand that philosophy, that mindset, because I I feel I've put out some bad content over the last few years. So it's 
Sweet. We are making progress. We are making progress. We are making progress here. And I don't understand how to get... Can I zoom in? No. Alright, I gotta go back down. The damn rope controls are terrible in this game. Alright, we're gonna go down, down, uh, down. We're gonna go down and over to the right. Oh, just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. Yeah, so there's some really awesome people on the stream tonight, so. You guys, please check everybody out because there's some awesome people on the stream. Damn it, I knew it was gonna, I knew it was gonna happen. Urgh. All right. Oh. Oh, this run's sucking here. This run is sucking. Go all the way over to the right. Uh, hit that. Hit that. Wait for the duck who's like stuck in limbo. Nice. Well, he got what was coming. Alright, we'll go up. We will go up. And try to keep progressing. Nice. 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 Get my bank. Give me that money. Oh, and I needed that ice cream cone. That's awesome. Alright, where do I go from here? Oh, come on. There it is. There's a rope. I knew I was missing something. Fall down the hole or not. Alright. Scrooge McDuck over here is making it rain. Getting all this money. Alright. What's the next item here we got? Yeah, that's awesome, man. I'm really excited to check out your video, Jim. I'm really excited to check out your video, Rob. So we've got Retro Rob, Retro Fusion Gaming, Jim Morrison's Bathtub who's doing something. Um, yeah, so a few really, really cool people. Alright, so now... I go all the way down, I think, to try to get to what I am assuming is the boss here. Get there, get there. All right. The Gibbs, my YouTube is cutting that off. I can't the uh, the Gibbs twenty four. I can't see who that is. My chat's cutting it off. All right, keep going down. Keep going down. Ah, that's cheap. That's cheap. Just going back through the level here. Rope controls are awful. All right, down. And then we're going to go down again. All right. 
Hold on, my chat's doing something stupid. There we go. Trying desperately not to die here. Oh, so close. I just want to make it to the boss. If I make it there, I'm happy with the run tonight. If I make it to the boss, I'll be happy with the run. Despite dying multiple times. And getting game overs and starting over multiple times. I'll be pretty happy getting to the boss. But I, like I've said it a lot tonight, but I, oh, what the hell? What cheese do I need? What? I have all the parts here. And I've gone, no, I guess I haven't gone any, everywhere on the map. Let me go back. Thank you for checking them uh, them out, uh, Retro Rob. I appreciate that. I know they do as well, but all right. So we can go up here and to the left or the right. Kill him. All right, so All right, so I guess we got to go to the right. The exploration in this game is pretty cool. It really is. But this game definitely is kind of like NES hard. Right. Oh. So now I'm stuck again. I need the cheese. There's a spot up there I can go. So we gotta go back down again. And back up. Oh, well that sucked. Oh, all right. Yeah, that jersey you posted on the uh, on the pick, uh, the Whalers jersey was sick, man. I love that hockey jersey. All right, um, thank you guys so much for coming out or and checking out the video, checking out the stream, hanging out, talking in the chat, subbing the channels. Um, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. I'm always blown away when people jump on the stream and watch and hang out. It's just so it's so much fun. Um, I, I really do appreciate it. Uh, you guys are awesome. I'm going to go play some Fallout 4 because of Jim Morrison's bathtub. It was either 3 or 4, and he talked me into 4. So I'm going to go hang out, play some Fallout 4, and just enjoy the rest of the night. So you guys have a good night. You're all legends, all rock stars. Uh, appreciate you guys so much. Uh, enjoy the rest of your night. Hang out. Have a good time. And uh, I'm going to try to be streaming more regular, regularly. Um, this is my second stream in less than a month, so I'm getting there. So, thank you guys. Um, yeah, appreciate you, man. Y'all have a good night, and um, we'll see you next time. Thank you, guys.